in this video we have been given that ap is 3 bp is 4 and cp is 5 then we have to find area of equilateral triangle abc so Suppose A is equal to 3, B is equal to 4, and C is equal to 5. Then, AP is A, BP is B, and CP is C. And suppose this area is x this area is y and this area is z then area of a b c it will be equal to x plus y plus z so we have to find x plus y plus z and a b c it is equilateral triangle so a b it will be equal to b c and it will be equal to c a so if we rotate triangle c p b such that CB coincide with CA, then point A, it will be B dash, and this point will be P dash. This triangle and this triangle is same. and bp is b so b dash p dash it will be also b and cp is c so cp dash will be c and if angle bcp is theta then angle b dash c p dash will be also theta and suppose this angle is alpha then in triangle ABC it is ABC this angle it is theta plus alpha and it is equilateral triangle that means theta plus alpha it will be equal to 60 degree and if we join pp dash then in triangle p c p dash PC is equal to P dash C that is C and this angle it is theta plus alpha that is 60 degree that means it will be equilateral triangle so P P dash it will be also C P P dash it is C and also area of B C P is G so area of B dash C P dash will be also G and
now area of a p c p dash it is equal to y plus z y plus z and it is also equal to area of a p p dash plus area of c p p dash so we get y plus z is equal to area of a p p dash plus area of c p p dash and y plus z it is equal to and a p p dash is a triangle with side length a b and c plus and c p p dash is a triangle with side length c and suppose area of triangle with side length a b and c is equal to area a b c then y plus z it will be equal to this is area a b c plus and area of equilateral triangle with side length c will be a square root of 3 by 4 times c square and if we move this triangle here then we get y plus z is equal to area of abc plus a square root of 3 by 4 c square so if we move this triangle here then this area will be y and again this angle will be 60 degree and this will be a so this will be a and b p dash it will be c so from here we can get x plus y is equal to area of a b c plus a square root of 3 by 4 a square and if we move this triangle here then this area will be x and from here we can get x plus z is equal to area of a b c plus a square root of 3 by 4 b a square so if we add x plus y y plus z and x plus z then x plus y it is area of a b c plus a square root of 3 by 4 a square plus and y plus z 
is area of ABC plus a square root of 3 by 4 C square plus and X plus Z is area of ABC plus a square root of 3 by 4 B square and it is x plus y plus y plus z plus x plus z is equal to and area of abc is 3 times so it is 3 times area of abc plus a square root of 3 by 4 a square plus a square root of 3 by 4 b square plus a square root of 3 by 4 c square and it is 2x plus 2y plus 2z is equal to 3 times area of abc plus and here we can take a square root of 3 by 4 common and it is a square plus b square plus c square and x plus y plus z it will be equal to 1 by 2 times 3 times area abc plus a square root of 3 by 4 times a square plus b square plus c square and in the given question we have a is equal to 3 b is equal to 4 and c is equal to 5 so x plus y plus z it will be equal to 1 by 2 times 3 times and area of ABC it is equal to area of a triangle with side length A, B and C. So here we have A is equal to 3, B is equal to 4 and C is equal to 5. And here we can see that 5 square is equal to 3 square plus 4 square. That means this angle will be 90 degree. So this area it will be equal to 1 by 2 times base is 3 and height is 4 that is 6. So, area of ABC is 6 plus a square root of 3 by 4 times A is 3 a square plus B is 4 a square plus C is 5 a square and X plus Y plus Z it is equal to 1 by 2 times 18 plus a square root of 3 by 4 times 9 plus 16 plus 25 and x plus y plus z it is area of a b c that is equal to 1 by 2 times 18 plus a square root of 3 by 4 times 50 and 2 times 2 is 4 and 2 times 25 is 50. So area of ABC it is equal to 18 by 2 will be 9 plus and this will be 25 times a square root of 3 by 2 times 2 will be 4. 
so area of abc it is 9 plus 25 times a square root of 3 by 4 it is 9 plus 25 times a square root of 3 by 4 